Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel that is EdTech. Hope you all guys are having a fantastic day. Let us begin with our today's video. So our today's video is going to be very important for all the people who are working in the IT industry or they are associated with the IT companies such as TCS, Cognizant, Accenture, Infosys, Wipro, HCL Tech, okay, a lot of other companies. So we are going to discuss one of the trending topic that is work from home ended for TCS employees. Okay, and why this is important for other companies employees as well. Okay, be it Cognizant, be it Accenture, Infosys, Wipro, HCL Tech. So it has been a history that whenever TCS makes a policy change, it can be a salary hike, it can be a HR policy change, it can be anything. Okay, the other companies follow. Okay, meaning that they also implement that policy or that salary hike or something like that if TCS is doing it. Okay, TCS is the one of the largest company in India as well as in the world. Okay, that is the reason a lot of companies try to follow and mimic their contribution and their uh, like implementations. Okay, so considering this, let us begin with our today's video. We will discuss that a, a trending news is going on in the uh, employees. Okay, that compulsory five days office will be there from starting this October. Okay, we will discuss everything in detail. Let us move forward. But guys, before moving forward, we have a small humble request. Please like this video and share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel because it will ultimately help you guys to get regular updates on the videos that we post about the IT industry. Okay, so let us move forward. Now, the number one thing that I want to tell you guys is that when TCA started, okay, this work from home, okay, then at that time what happened was the attrition raise rate literally lowered, okay, when TCA started work from home, compulsory work from home for everyone, right, in COVID time. So what, what has happened, okay, after that, after everything is cooled out, they have call, started calling employees back to office in a hybrid model. For example, they were earlier calling two days to office, okay, and that is the reason what happened was the attrition started going high and high. Okay, here you can see April, June, it was low. And then again, you can see that it is going high and higher and high. Okay, it's starting going in the year 2022. They again did it for 20, uh, like three days, right? From two days uh, work from home, uh, work from office, they did three days work from office, right? And that is the reason where the attrition level peaked for Infosys, for Wipro, be it TCS and everyone. Okay, here you can see in during the mid -de uh, December, okay, December 2022, the attrition was at the peak. Okay, a lot of employees were leaving because startups were on the other hand, the startups were giving them uh, work from home opportunities for all five days. Okay, remote jobs, a lot of other things, right? Now, what has happened right now, they have keep kept the uh, work from office policy for three days only okay constantly for like six to eight months right now so that is the reason attrition has lowered okay in march in jan to march quarter the attrition lowered and that is the reason they are in a good good uh scenario okay they are in good position right now tcs and all of the companies such as tcs now let me tell you guys there has been a news that is being circulated okay uh, with all the employees of tcs that tcs is soon going to make five days office compulsory for every of its employee now, a lot of people might think what will happen to its 2025 model wherein they will plan uh, planning to have only 25% of it, its workforce in the office, rest 75% will be working from home, okay? But let me tell you guys that they have not mentioned that the entire people, out of the entire people, only 25 will be working in the office, right? So there can be a possibility that they will uh, like shift it, okay? They will be doing some combination, permutations and combination that, for example, there are 10 people, okay? Out of the 10 people, three people or two people will be coming to office on monday two people will be coming to office on tuesday so they can do this also okay so we need to consider this as well so a lot of people have this uh, like doubt that uh, if they are saying 25 per percent of people only 25 percent people will be there no that is not true okay they can shift it as well okay they can play with the number as well so tell me, one more important thing is that this news is not confirmed from any of the teacher thesis hr official yet okay the hr head or the hr managers Okay, so a lot of people or a lot of project managers on their own basis, okay, what they're doing is they are circulating this message that you have to come to office so that the people who are not coming one day, two days or even three days. So at least they come to office for three days, right? So this is what they're trying to do. Okay, and there are some auditing and everything is happening from the client side as well. That are your employees coming to office? Are you, are you giving them enough salaries? Okay, a lot of employees, uh, I mean, a lot of clients are doing these audits okay so i if you your team is has also faced any kind of audit do let us know in the comment section if your manager is calling you for five days office okay do let us know in the comment section and what is the reason they are calling five days i can understand it for we can also understand it for uh, projects which are related to testing right so some projects which are related to uh government banks okay government uh like uh, like NACs, BACs, okay. So these people have some critical data which cannot be given out into the laptops out in the public, right? So that is the reason some projects definitely need defense projects, okay, 
uh, they also they definitely need the work from office okay but some projects do not need work from office right they can also do it from home okay and one more important thing is that traveling okay so traveling is one another key aspect which a lot of people are facing issues with okay so if you're in a metro cities most of the tcs and all the companies offices are in metro cities pune kolkata bangalore chennai uh, pune, uh, and again mumbai okay and noida and lot of other things right so these companies have huge traffic heavy traffic right and that is the reason they are spending 2 to 3 hours every day traveling commuting to work to office office to work right so that is the reason they are wasting a lot of time and if you consider 9 of work are hours of work it is almost going to 12 hours okay that is the reason a lot of people are worried now if you are doing the same thing if you are getting 2 to 3 hours for traveling to and fro then do let us know in the comment section okay now the next thing is that yes definitely testing projects some projects require you to come to office day, daily so that is ex like expectable and that you can expect as well okay from the company that you have to maintain the decorum of the client and the rules and requirements right so guys do let us know in the comment section what kind of problems you are facing and let us try to find a solution on that as well okay so we have started replying to all the comments that you're putting in the telegram group as well as on the youtube videos so do let us know in the comment section if you have any doubts thank you so much so much for watching this video guys and please subscribe to our youtube channel because that is very important thank you and have a good day